Army Recognition Editorial Team is in Czech Republic to make a full coverage about the Czech company CZ. CZ is one of the world leaders in the manufacturing of small arms. I'm now with uh, Jacob, marketing manager at CZ, who will introduce for us uh, the company and some of the weapons. Uh, first, can you introduce yourself? Yes, I'm a Jacob and I work as the, uh, on the marketing department of the CZ. Uh, I know that CZ is one of the world leaders of manufacturing of small arms. Uh, today we have the chance to see a live firing of test firing of uh, weapons and also we, you will introduce uh, first uh, some of the weapons um, of CZ. Uh, yes, those are actually the weapons that we uh, had opportunity to try uh, today on the shooting range. So it's uh, some part of our production program. You can see around that we are producing much more different types of weapons, uh, and we are producing those for uh, mostly for the for eight years till now. Uh, but we were concentrated on the military and law enforcement segment. So we had opportunity to test a South rifle, submachine gun, and some of the handguns we produce for the military and law enforcement. First, maybe can you give me some details about uh, the CZ-805, uh, the assault rifle of CZ company? Yes, the CZ-805 uh, brand is actually the primary weapon of the Czech soldier today. And it's also serving together with our soldiers in the foreign missions in uh, Iraq, Afghanistan, Mali, and so on. Uh, we are producing two basic types, uh, A1 and A2. The gun is gas piston driven, so it uses the gas to move the, move the uh, uh, bolt and bolt carrier. Also, uh, it's chambered in a, a 5.56 caliber, uh, 45 NATO. Uh, which was the demand for the, for the Czech army, so we are offering this gun in a, in a disc configuration. The mainframe is uh, built from alloy. We saw the uh, production earlier today. Uh, it's a very suitable gun for the military operatives, I would say. Also, we have a very good feedback because the gun is serving in a very difficult conditions and in a very difficult environment together with our troops, so, so far it works very well. So we are happy for them that we were uh, able to deliver the product that they can rely on in 100%. Also, we are very welcome any kind of feedback from the, from the military. So we are trying to implement this kind of feedback into our future products and into our innovations. Maybe you can explain the main features of the weapons and maybe the techn technology used by CZ uh, to manufacture this type of weapons. Yes, well, as we, as we, as we said earlier, the gun is um, gas piston driven. There is, a, of course, there is a, there is a standard to like uh, uh, folding and adjustable stock over there. You have a mode of fire, so you're able to uh, have the gun on the safety one round, two rounds, or full automatic burst. The gun is suitable for the left-handed and right-handed shooter as well, so you can actually adapt the gun the way the operator needs it. Uh, plus, it's uh, compatible with the AR-15 magazine, so you can use those type of magazines or the accessory produced worldwide. Uh, there are standard picatinny rails on the gun, so you're able to adapt it with any kind of accessory like uh, red dots, torch lights, laser pointers, uh, or whatever. Also, with the gun, we are able to supply the suppressor, you can also regulate the amount of the gas used to, to work the gun for the standard and for the very rough conditions like dusty environment, sand and uh, uh, so on. Or in the case you haven't got opportunity to clean the gun so often, so after a few thousand rounds you just switch for the, for the higher, higher pressure and you are able to work with the gun uh, actually for, for a very long time and the gun is very, very durable. It 
if you compare to other uh, weapons, uh, what is the main uh, difference between the other? Uh, well, definitely, I would say it's a durability of the gun. Uh, because originally it was designed for a uh, 7.62 caliber as well. So all the internal parts, all the body and all the, all the main parts over here were designed for a higher pressure, for a higher caliber. Uh, that means that, you know, uh, 5.56 literally it's unbreakable gun.